What's up, travelers? I am in Bologna, Italy, and everybody has told me that I gotta come to this place and try their tortellini in broth. Hello, my name is Varun, a really cool guy in a boat. You can be really cool guy like Varun if you subscribe to Tasting Travel right now. If you do not subscribe, I'll be ah ah. You're welcome. I am sitting at Spaglia Arena and this place has been open since 1963 and I hear their tortellini is absolutely excellent. I just ordered a Coke. They said they didn't have any Coke so they gave me a bio cola instead. And the bottle is super cool. So, you know, while we're waiting, we might as well give that a taste. It smells good. Mmm, that bites. That bites heavy. That's good. Oh yeah, if that was in the United States, I would switch immediately. <laughs> Coke, Pepsi, RC, it would all be done with, because that stuff is awesome. One really kind of fun thing that they've done here is they've put the silverware through a piece of uh, is that rotini I think I don't know I'm not entirely sure on my pasta shapes <laughs> we've got our tortellini in broth here and we've got looks like some sort of a a biscuit or a crumpet or something like that and then we got some uh, some nice 
pumpkin cake or something like that. I don't know. We'll find out. But let's go ahead and try this broth here. Mm. Oh yeah, that's that's a very tasty, tasty chicken broth. Exactly what you'd be wanting on a nice cold day like we're having here in Italy today. So we've got these tortellinis here. Now let's give it a shot. See what's inside them. sort of a pork sausage no cheese or anything it's just just straight up pork sausage and, and pasta and it is absolutely delicious it's quite the rush of flavor mm. I guess we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll try this uh, mystery <laughs> Yeah, it's like a savory pumpkin pie. Not bad. This is a great comfort food right here. Chicken noodle soup. Why go with that when you can have pork noodle soup? <laughs> so from my understanding, Bologna is responsible for giving us tortellini. And I imagine it's quite the quite the process to put all of these together. I mean, it, it, it's got to be very time consuming. And one thing about this place is they they sell their handmade noodles here, and they, they make them in the kitchen. And uh, yeah, it just looks like quite a little business that they got going on here. Let's try this puck. <laughs> Yeah, it's definitely some sort of a bread. Mm. A lot of yeast in it. No, that's, that's nice. I'd like to take some of those home with me. Yeah, that, that, that pumpkin pie, it's, it's weird. Uh, <laughs> being an American, whenever you want pumpkin pie, you, you know, you're expecting something sweet and spicy. This is just, just pumpkin. <laughs> yeah, that's been pureed and then formed into the shape of a pie and then cut and then baked. Yeah, so, it's a tortellini. I think it's pretty good. I'd give it an 8 out of 10 probably. My broth. I'll give it a 9. <laughs> well, did I just start rating food like that now? <laughs> that's, that's new for me. <laughs> but this cola, this cola is fantastic. I could get down on that. And there's a flavor in that cola I'm just not recognizing and it is just delicious. I definitely would suggest coming to Svogia Rita and getting some tortellini. They have a lot of other stuff on their menu. Uh, most of it is around their tortellini so there's lots of ways you can go about it. Yeah, I highly suggest coming here if you're ever in Bologna. But worth your time and your, your effort to get here. It's been very enjoyable. But if you've enjoyed this video, please give me a like, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and I'll let you know whenever we upload a new video. And as always, eat great food.